Hey there everyone, Mary Pittman here from Fitness Alliance International. Welcome back to Gimme 10 where we help you transform your life 10 at a time. Now we are traveling through our 10 training principles or fitness training principles. Uh, so we are almost halfway through. Last time we talked about adaptation and basically getting used to your training program, mixing it up a little so you get better results. Now leading off the back end of that, as you can still see here behind me, we've got the adaptation curve. Now that's still there because diminishing returns comes at the top end of adaptation. So basically, as I explained, you change up your program just that little bit, your skill level drops slightly. But as you get used to the new program, the new movements, your skill and your results actually improve What's the word? Hmm, exponentially. So, coming off the top end of the exponential growth, we actually have a flat, a bottoming out, a flattening out, where you'll still be doing the same thing, you may still be getting some gains, but they're not as extreme as you've seen in the recent times leading up to that point. Or it's also known as a plateau. So, basically you're doing the same thing, you're not getting any results or you're not getting as good results. So that again, as I mentioned in adaptation, is where you go and see your trainer or your gym manager or someone at the gym who can help you change up your, uh, your program just slightly, put in a new aerobics class, put in a new uh, weight training session, mix it up a little bit, put your body into shock, and we wanna see that drop in skill again, okay? It may seem like a bad thing at the time. It's only temporary. Your body will get used to it. And again, you'll see this exponential growth and improvement in your uh, development. And of course, also in your uh, ability to pick out different exercises that may actually be able to benefit you further. So, quick, short, sweet, diminishing returns. This is Gimme 10. I'm Mary Pittman from Fitness Alliance International. And I'll see you next time.